Shock identity of child revealed. Queen knows right away Lilibet's photo is fake. How the hell do the royals get themselves out of this embarrassing mess? In the lead up to the Queen's Jubilee, the royals were inundated with correspondence from groups who support the royal family, informing them that if Harry and the actress attended the event, they would be booed on the streets. As forecasted, this happened. Harry couldn't hide his feelings of shock and horror. The downcast expression on his face told the graphic story. Now, the family has to decide how they will cope with two invisible children who are in the line of succession. Forget the fake stories coming out from their poodle, Omid Scobie, telling us about meetings with the Queen and a birthday party with the Royals, it didn't happen. The panic, brought on by how to deal with the problem, must be worrying the family, of course it is. They know the public aren't stupid enough to believe the pantomime they're watching playing out on a daily basis. The Royals must be wondering for how long this deceit can continue. The palace isn't saying anything about it, there's no proof to show us what a mess they're in. We have two children in the line of succession and nobody knows what they look like. The Queen is refusing to show us a genuine picture of herself with her great-grandchildren. We should start to wonder why. But people are now beginning to ask, is Harry in panic too? How can he get out of this? For whatever reason, he went along with Markle's scam, but Harry knows this cannot continue forever. It's been made perfectly clear to Harry that he and his wife could be charged with high treason. He will know that to attempt to undermine the lawfully recognised line of succession leaves him open to imprisonment. This is serious. The world was scammed when Markle's PR people released this photo with her consent. She didn't claim it was a daughter, the invisible Lily, but news agencies believed it was. Markle's PR people worked hard to spread the news. American TV personality Stasi Schroeder had a baby daughter with her husband, casting agent Bew Clark. Here he is holding their daughter. The baby looks exactly like Lilibet. Harry and Meghan make out they're still crucial to the monarchy when the kids are seventh and eighth in the line of succession. Of course they're not necessary, but if the reaction at the Platinum Jubilee is any indication, they've gotten a rude awakening that saw them flee back to Cali with their tails between their legs. The Sussex squad and the Harkles can cry all they want about Lily and Archie not having titles, but neither child is essential. The only great-grandchildren of Her Majesty the Queen who have titles are George, Charlotte and Louis. Their father, Prince William, will one day be king, and the kids having monikers now makes it easier in the long run. Archie and Lily were never entitled to have titles at birth, as they are great-grandchildren, not grandchildren of the current monarch. When their grandfather, Prince Charles, becomes king, they are to be given princely titles, However, given their parents' behaviour, this might not happen due to the Prince of Wales' slimmed-down monarchy. The drama could have been avoided if the situation had played out differently. If Harry and Meghan had done what they said they would do and wanted to live a private life, their children would have been treated the same as the Cambridge kids when the time came. 